Okay, guys, here we go. This is a, a radio that which was purchased off the website, roostercb.com. Uh, Mirage 36 HP3 by Ranger. Uh, for a straight AM radio, I really don't know what else you could want. Uh, I really like these a lot. Really nice little radios. Uh, blue channel display. Uh, really nice, slick. Uh, Echo, talkback, RF power, all that. I have a detailed video of one of these on the channel. Uh, but I just want to do this one kind of as a refresher, uh, show you what these things are capable of doing. And uh, we're going to take a look at average power and uh, peak power on it. And we'll take a look at how the average power affects the amount of current that this radio draws. Now the peak power is going to remain the same no matter where we set our carrier or our dead key at. But as I'll show you guys, the average power comes up. And as it does, uh, the current that this radio uh, draws uh, comes up as well. So, uh, that being said, talk back. Hello, one, one, two, one, two, three, audio, one, two, audio. So, I actually like the talk back on these pretty good. It's not too bad. Uh, but uh, we'll show you what we've got going on here. We've got the RF power all the way down. Uh, we're going to come over here and we're on the right scale. So, we'll just give it a good audio, RF power all the way down. Audio, two and a half amps. Now, all I'm gonna do, guys, I'm gonna turn the RF power wide open. Audio, audio. So a full two amps more. And guess what, the peak power doesn't change. We'll demonstrate all that here in just a second. Let's get over to the uh, watt meter. So we've got our 50 watt uh, slug in here, 50 watt element. We could use a 100 watt one, uh, but we'll use a 50. Go ahead and go to average power. RF power is wide open right there. That's about a 12 watt day key. And with the RF power all the way down, less than a watt. So you get less than a watt all the way down, 12 watts all the way up. Now let's check average power, wide open. Hello, audio. So it's showing about 35 watts average from a 12 watt day key. Uh, we'll go halfway. Hello, almost 30. That's a 10 watt day key. Audio. And now we'll go all the way down. Hello, 15 watts average. Just talking into the mic. Hello, radio. Hello, radio. We got our mic gain at 2 o'clock. Let's come on up to 3 o'clock. Hello, radio. Hello, radio. Audio. 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2. Audio. Audio in about 15. And uh, hello, radio. Just talking about 12 watts average. Now, we're going to keep our dead key all the way down, all the way to the left, check peak power, check, 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 about 50 watts PEP, and we're going to turn it wide open, it shouldn't change the peak power at all, check, 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 Show so, so showing, excuse me, about 50 watts plus PEP. Now with the 100 watt slug in there, I think it shows about 48. So the 50 reads a little more, excuse me, than the 100 watt slug or element. Um, but that's it. So you guys saw the difference was peak power stayed the same from all the way down here to all the way up here. Uh, average power increased drastically. Matter of fact, it doubled. And as the average power doubled, so did the amount of current that it pulled. So people that say, I don't care what average power is, I only care about peak, or, uh, you might want to reconsider that because average power uh, does matter. Um, you know, It's just a measurement of uh, the RF that we're putting out, but there is a correlation between average power and especially the amount of current that something draws. Um, if you were wondering what kind of amp you could run with this, uh, one of the four pill shorty 2879s would be a great one. 
uh, one of the four pill 454s would be a good one or even an eight pill 454. That's my recommendations if you want to run an amp with this guy. Uh, if not, find a little radio by itself. Hope you guys enjoy. Again, uh, lots of packages going out. Please be patient. I know there's lots of people waiting on orders. Trust me, I have been packing and shipping all day long. So if you haven't got a tracking number, be looking for it. Catch you guys out there. Rooster in Tennessee. See you. Bye.